everyone, welcome back to the channel. In today's video, we'll be doing a quick follow-up based on one of the questions one of my viewers asked in part one of this series of how to connect to the Raspberry Pi Pico W in AP mode. And that question was how to connect to AP mode while using a static IP address because this can have some use cases in terms of network structure and predictability of your server. So I thought that was a good question and some other viewers like that question. So I thought I'd do a quick video just to show how to do that. And thankfully, it's really easy to do if you watch part one, which I'll link right here. And if you watch part one, it's essentially only adding one line of code on top of the code we already wrote. So that is this code right here, where we define the, the static IP address we'd like to connect to right here, and some other network parameters, which we're not gonna get into in the scope of this video due to them being a little advanced, but these are just some other parameters to define the network structure. And so once you have this, you can connect to this static IP address. And so let's just show how that works here by running this code. So I'm just going to run that. Let me close this. So we can see that the IP address is this address we just set, which is good. So now we just want to go to connect to it based on the, the name and the password we set for the network. So I just named it name in this case, as you can see here in the password is password. I already connected to this before, so it should not ask for the password again, as we could see. And so going to Google Chrome, we are going to go to that network, 192.4.3 in this case, and it should show hello world. So that's how you do it. I hope I answered your question, and I hope you guys find some use in this answered question.